Is that for Foxidas? A gift? No. It's a relic. I don't want to talk about it, Damastis. Isn't that Bayek's? Let me have it. I'll give it to Foxidas myself. He loves these things. I'll kill you. How about that? I'm in no mood for compromise today. We passed Neopolis in the crack of morning. With strong wind, you'll be standing in Rome's forum in... Uh, two days' time. It's over between you and Bayek, eh? I can feel... No decision is easy. But you are a chosen one. And now you are free! <laughs> like me! So begins a new day. Don't drop your guard entirely. We should assume they are expecting us. You sound thrilled about it. Eager, old man. Eager to be done with this scum. And move on to the next pile of scum. Infinite scum! Such is the world we live in. Those flares will summon their navy. Prepare yourselves! Fire ships left! More fire ships close! 
Olympus. No, no! Gally it's Brutus and Cassius! Look! And our catapult Gally with them! Put them to use! Brace! Hey! Don't Let's fear go. this beast! She's a great and girthy whale! But we'll dance around her bulk like minnows in a pond! You weren't a poet in your youth, were you, Foxidas? Oh, ho, ho, ho. I shouldn't be like me! She belongs in there, too! Ah, what we shouldn't be! A million pieces that I. You must write your memoirs one day. I may just do. And if you promise to sneak one copy into the library, I'll let you believe on. Surely these chapters will be the most widely read of all. Ready! Up the pace, brother! Go to Hunter! Golly, see! Gally speed! Arrows in! Off the tempo! Gally speed! Easy pace! Let's go! Gally speed! Gally speed! What port are you taking us to? There is a town called Antium I'd like to try. Lots of merchants sail in and out of there. Should be safe for you. From there, it's a half day's ride to Rome. It is only a matter of days before Caesar will officially become a tyrant. There he is. People love you, Caesar. You're a god. The 
Senate will not bow so easily. A parliament of clucking heads. Let me be your wolf. Nothing until I give this in. is the king of the order now. Father of understanding. You and Caesar will die. You are meddling with the affairs of the order. Order is greater than Rome. Go back to Egypt with the rest of the liars and slaves. You make me understand why murder is just. I command armies. I control greatness. I will erase your order from the annals. Kneel to Caesar. Kneel to Rome. It feels good to side with winners. We are the writers of history. Caesar will follow you to oblivion. Your son pissed himself when he saw the knife. I will feed your heart to punches. You have no honor. You stole everything from me. I am a Gabignani. I thought you would scurry away, little one. You should have taken your chance to drop off the map. Flavius isn't here to save this time, Septimus. No Roman deals will be made. My son's heart, for your life. Was revenge everything you hoped? You and the Medjai shall drench the sheets with your sweat tonight. <laughs> this stuff. With the Order, I served them and your beloved Egypt. And I'll be rewarded in the afterlife. An eternity. Drinking and whoring with my brothers. The only thing that waits for you is oblivion. For your name, your order, and the rotten corpses of your Gavignani. Up and devour your fetid heart. rest of the Senate.
This place is crawling with soldiers. Con pute!
I ask only this, that you join with me in building a new Rome. A Rome with you as king? Let Caesar speak! We want a Rome that offers justice, peace and land to all its citizens, not just the privileged few. You are just as privileged as I. I am not dictator for life. An honor bestowed upon me by the people of Rome. Would you have me refuse such a gift? We would have you think of Rome before yourself. I will unite the Republic. Senatus Populusque Romanus. For the Senate and the people of Rome. Republic? You speak of Republic while coveting a crown? Marcus Antonius offered me the crown at the Lupercalia festival. I refused it. And what a pretty play it was. You don't need a crown. They have made you a god! Mark me, Gaius Cassius Longinus. Support me in my dreams for Rome, and old divisions will be forgotten. Senators, the war is over! The drums of dissent have reached a fever pitch. Rome will not be a monarchy again. It seems Brutus would start a revolution. But against what, my friend? We desire the same things. How can you say that when you have raised yourself so far above the people? I speak for the people. You have seized the rights of the citizenry. No. 
the people infused with fear and blinded by patriotism offered up all of their rights to their leader and did it gladly so. Who made you leader of Rome? The eternal city herself. Caesar will not be reasoned with. Senators, we still have a voice in this forum. I will hear your complaints. Caesar deigns to listen. Romans rejoice. You are free now! Do I know you? You who strikes from the shadows. The same fate will come to all despots. In the end... It is impossible not to become what others believe you are. And I was a god! There is a new creed now. Yeah! Rome is eternal! She will never fall to you or your kind. Freedom is not given, Caesar. It is taken. Requiescat in pace, Caesar. <laughs> 